missing that key player on your team and do not have the coins to afford him, check out CheapMaddenCoins.com for the best coin buying and selling service. Use code SAVAGE for 15% off. So today, guys, I'm going to be answering a question that has been popping up quite frequently in my comment section over the past couple of videos I've uploaded this week. That question is, yo, Sav, do you think that you're going to play Weekend League in Madden 20 ever again to try to get top 100? Now, rather than just leaving a simple answer under a comment with no real in-depth explanation uh, i just kind of felt like that wouldn't be like the right thing to do i'd rather you know come out since it has been a very frequent question i figure it is a good uh video topic to kind of just you know clear the air for anybody who is wondering this and maybe you were thinking this and you just never decided to comment and ask um, but a lot of people know that uh, at the beginning of that in 20, I pretty much made the statement that I'm only going to play one full weekend league, uh, a whole month's worth. I played in August. We got top 100 every week. We got top 100 for the month. And, you know, that was cool. That was great. You know, it was awesome. Yeah, weekend league greatness but the big reason that i didn't want to go ahead and play weekend league every single week this year is because it, it trapped my content i'm gonna be honest with you uh back in like you know madden 18 when, when it first came out it was great but then you know it just became super stale madden 19 i thought i was going to be able to like you know really stunt with it and you know it was great at first but then it really dropped off i just don't think weekend league rewards and weekend league itself has that you know that potency anymore it's not as cool as it was when it first came out that's just my personal take on it and as a content creator i feel like you know it really limited my growth it limited my channel stimulation to keep you know numbers up and it was a, a decision that i decided to make and i said you know what i'm just gonna you know focus on more fun content rather than you know just the same content you know what i mean different fun versus the same uh, the same gets stale you know if you're different and stuff it, it makes it a lot better not to mention uh weekend league also really does uh I, for me at least um i guess it's because i'm also a content creator for the game it drains me bad like really 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 uh bad 25 games of weekend league it you know it takes about like you know 8 to 12 hours it's rough and you know for me at least as a content creator i also play the game you know during the week to make other videos um so i'm you know it's like i'm constantly on the game i'm constantly on the game when you're putting an extra eight to 12 hours into it when you really like technically for content i don't need to do that that was just something that i was like forcing my i felt like i had to i felt like i had to like prove something to i don't know who i was trying to prove something to i was like if i don't get top 10 people are gonna hate me like, I was like, you know, I was forcing myself to do all that for like no reason, essentially, because um, like, I, I, I don't know, man, I, I just felt like I had to do it. I don't know what I think I was trying to just I, I felt like I felt like if I didn't do it, like I wasn't fulfilling like what I was trying to. I don't even know, bro. There was, I was I'm crazy, bro. I was crazy last year playing 25 games every single week. Same in Madden 18. I don't know how I did it because I definitely, definitely couldn't do it this year. And, you know, in terms of fun and content now, this is probably the most fun I've had on YouTube now in the past two years, like through Madden 18, through Madden 19. And a big reason is, is because I'm not playing Weekend League every weekend. Because when I play Madden, it's not because I'm forcing myself because, oh my God, I need to get at least 23 wins to get top 10, to get packs. Because if I don't get these packs, nobody's going to want to watch me and this, this, this. Now when I play Madden, I'm just like, all right, we buying a new card and we're gonna go ahead and see if we can stop the run but i'm doing it like once a day sometimes twice a day if i want to double upload and it's the most fun i've been having and honestly thank you guys because these these past couple of videos that i've uploaded in the past week have been some of like you know my higher viewed gameplay videos recently and i hope that it keeps up i really do and you know i this video might not get that many views because a lot of people might not click on it just because um I mean, maybe it will just because it has Weekend League in the top. I don't know. But, you know, uh, this isn't a live commentary by any means. This is just some Weekend League gameplay um, from last night. Because, uh, ironically enough, everybody, I guess, qualified for Weekend League. And I said, you know what? Yo, let me just hop into a, a game and, like, see, like, what, what what's everything's about. And, um, yeah, I was like, all right. Well, definitely don't want to play 25 games of this, Madden. Uh, I mean, most of the, the gameplay that you're watching, though, it, it was the one kid quit right away. And then... This kid I was just messing around with. I was just trying to run around with Vic and do stupid stuff. Um, but, yeah, I mean, like, the big thing, though, uh, also, um, not only does it, you know, give me time off of the game, which is my job, 
and it gives me, you know, more creative juices because I'm not limiting myself to, okay, well, on these days, I need to be playing weekend league. If I'm not playing weekend league, I won't have videos for this week. You know, that, that I kind of felt like I was on a sketch, like a really strict schedule, like a weekend league was kind of like my thing. But now, you know, I'm doing like, whether it's like a pack and play squad builder, you know, just fun stuff, like stuff like that. So it's definitely been more, you know, relaxing on me. But, but the big, the big thing for me this year, because I do believe though, that if, and actually, let me just explain this first. So the big reason why I don't feel like playing weekend league, especially in this Madden, is because of the abilities. I hate the abilities. I really do. I dislike them so much. Um... As I try to scramble with Vic, I mean, like that, but that—that's like all I—that's like my fun. That's like my escape. It, ironically enough, it's called Escape Artist is Chem, but like that's like my escape from all like the stupid stuff in this game. I just do something. I, cause I'm, I'm, I just, I just want to have fun. So I'm like, you know what? Let's just run with Vic, and I run in circles. I don't care. I, I don't, I don't care. I don't care if I win. I don't care if I lose. I just am here to have fun, bro. It's a video game. You gotta, you got I gotta get like, I got that, that whole. Like, if I, if I wanted to be, you know, in the top one percent again, I could in a second. But this year, in my opinion, it's just not worth it because, it, like, how the game is meant to be played, which is a run-heavy game. Boring. I like to have fun my way. And if I do run the ball, I'm gonna make sure I got supersonic speed, Vic, in the backfield, that so I can just run in circles for a two-yard gain after I run all the way back to my own end zone and then all the way forward across. Like, for I, dude. The abilities, bro, are the... They tried so hard. They really did. They'll never say it. They'll never say it. They'll act like they were the best things ever. If Madden 21 has abilities, bro... Oh, my... Dude. Bro. Bro. We barely enjoyed red cam abilities, and then they went overboard with this. Now, listen. If you are an indifferent human being, like, if you're... Like, I don't want to call you strange because that's kind of an insult. But if you enjoy abilities, um, I want you to go ahead, comment down below. Say, I enjoy abilities so I can just make sure that I hide user from channel so that you can never comment on my videos again. Bro, I'm, <laughs> I'm just kidding. Uh, no, I'm serious. But, dude, I hate abilities. So, they're just so dumb. Because last year in Madden 19, um, you know, you either got highballed to death or you got playmaker to death. But... If you were a good enough player, those didn't end your game. This year? <laughs> bruh. You get stiff-armed. The running back becomes invincible so that nobody else can engage with him. And then he's gone. Or you get juked out of your socks and nobody else can engage, engage with this uh, runner because he has a juke, mega juke activated. And then he's gone. You have to be tackling specific players with other specific players. And it's just like... In previous Madden, 7 out of 10 times, if you played the scraper on a stretch and you tackled them, they were dead. Like, not dead. They, the run was dead. They didn't actually die in the game. This is not NFL Blitz on the Nintendo 64. But, dude, that was the end of the run. 7 out of 10 times, if you shot a gap on a zone run, the, the run was dead. Now, or, or like, and when I say dead, I mean they might have, you know, got like 2 yards. But, I mean, for the most part, they're not averaging 6 yards a clip, bro. It's crazy. Like, it is crazy. It is nuts. It's, it's freaking crazy. Um, it really is crazy to me. I don't know. I, like, I, it's just wow, man. It's really wow. You know, Madden 18 was hard to run, like, like stop the running. Um, until the end of the year. The end of the year, I think when we got enough secure tacklers on the field, uh, it was really easy to stop the run. But now you only got three dudes you can put out there, bro. And if you ain't got the three dudes in the right spot and you ain't tackling the running back with the super cam, bro, GG's in the chat. R.I.P. R.I.P. Because, dude, it's over. Like, and it's crazy to think that, though. Because now I've watched so many, you know, Madden tournaments now on Twitch where no dude passes the ball once. Like, why pass the ball? Why would you pass the ball? Why would you pass the football? Why? 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 You're going to pass the football with a risk of throwing an interception? Like, think of it like this. Ready? I'm going to riddle. I'm going to riddle you. When you throw the football in this game with how zone coverage is, bro, they could pick that ball off, right? You might pick up 12 yards if you catch the ball to like a 12-yard corner. Why would you do that when you could stiff arm somebody into oblivion and then become invincible and score a touchdown? Tell me. Listen, EA, if you ever see this video, which you won't because you don't like me, I'm going to be honest. We're football fans. You, whoever's watching this video right now, you buy this game because you love football. 
you don't care if there's abilities in the game. I bought this football game to play a football game with football players. I did not buy a football game to play a football game with Dragon Ball Z characters. Okay? Okay. I love you guys a lot. And I hope that you understand my decision on why I probably won't be playing Weekend League this year. Granted, they put a vanilla Weekend League in this game, meaning no abilities for one weekend. I will win 25 games. I love you all. Have a wonderful rest of your night.